I have a very special three-part series for you guys. This is a three-part mock consisting of, it's a fire dozer and transport, consisting of a tractor, a dozer tender, and the dozer itself, along with the trailer, which will group with the semi. Anyways, let's get started. So in this video showcase, I'm going to show you guys this custom LEGO Fire Dozer Tender. These are vehicles that are lightweight, usually pickups with maintenance rears that follow the company dozer transports and dozers when fighting wildfires and have basic maintenance tools, fuel, basically all the necessities to keep these dozers tuned and running in the field. They're pretty cool trucks, some are equipped as brush trucks, most don't have enough room though. So yeah. Now this particular truck is inspired, if I remember correctly, by a Dodge front end. There's no specific manufacturer that this is based around. I just built want a truck that I just based around all the bunch of the ones you can find on Google Images and just kind of mishmash them together. I was fairly happy with it. I'm fairly happy with this design though. I do feel that it's a little t bulky kind of feeling. It, it's kind of hard. Five wide is kind of hard to get just right. There's a there's a very fine art to it at least getting the proportions to feel right. While it does look fairly simple, the front end is a miniature work of art, as getting all of these different parts to line up and look good was a freaking pain in the butt. However, I'm very thankfully very happy with what I was able to do, and it also has a built-in function, one of the two of the whole dozer tender. There is a fully functional winch. The rear body itself contains a bunch of equipment compartments with these, uh, very, with these simulated handles. I didn't actually, these are all un unfunctional, which yes, is not stereotypical of me. And there's actually, there is room to store tools back here in this rear compartment, it goes up to about here. However, this whole front area is actually the winch. It's pretty bulky, but I ended up having to do it. We also got this crossbar across the top behind the cab to allow for the sign to be put up. And of course, there's also in the rear here, we got some basic details. The bumper is pretty easy to knock off. There's a trailer hitch. I think I was going to develop a trailer for this, but I never did. And again, as I said, there are tools stored back here, and it is literally packed full. It's a pain in the butt to pack those back in, so I'm not going to pull them out, but just know there's a bunch of fire tools back in there. Anyways, though, that's it. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this really cool mock, one of these really cool mock showcases, whatever part you're actually watching here. As always, don't forget to comment any thoughts below, like if you do, and subscribe. If you want to see more. As always, happy building and bye for now.